We were notified um, earlier in the day, uh, this morning, that there was a, a possibility of some patients coming in uh, that were contaminated with an unknown source. Uh, we ended up with seven patients. Uh, again, like I said, the uh, source was unknown at that time. Uh, so we went ahead and uh, did all, all our decon as if we, we were expecting a mass amount of people. Uh, but when it's an unknown source, we always start off that way rather than trying to ramp it up later on. We just take it right to the top from the very beginning. So if you guys walk us through, what did they go through? Uh, when the patients got here, all the patients came right through the entrance to the south garage. Uh, their first place uh, was right here above us. You'll see a trident. Uh, that's our deluge area. Each one of them had to be in that area for three to five minutes. Uh, from there, uh, they were taken to uh, the privacy showers, which is behind the blue tarps there. Uh, there at the privacy showers, uh, they were uh, undressed. Most of their uh, jewelry and everything was taken away from them, uh, put into uh, bags for the individual patients. Um, decontamination people were in there in full decontamination suits, um, giving them instructions on what to do, uh, where to wash, how to wash. Uh, at that point, they were given soap and sponges and uh, were able to um, clean themselves off. From there, uh, they transitioned to what we call our green zone, uh, where they were given additional towels, blankets, and gowns to protect their privacy. And then they were moved off into uh, the next zone, which is our medical triage zone where clinical people were staffed uh, to triage them and get them as quickly into the emergency care center as possible. What is the preparation process like for this? Uh, the preparation process can be pretty intense. Um, actually today, and I'm very, uh, you see me smile, I'm very proud of the decontamination team. From the time we were notified that this was happening to the time we had water running and I had personnel actually in decontamination uh, suits with uh, powered air respirators was under 30 minutes. 